introduce you to our newest programmer, Rob Argue, who has just joined our team last week. So we're going to find out some about your history. So can you tell us what you were doing before you came here? Uh, right before I came here, I was doing my master's at University of Maryland, uh, computer science naturally, with a focus in artificial intelligence. Can you expound on what you did for artificial intelligence, just for my own curiosity? <laughs> Um, I really did a lot of different things for it, uh, from machine learning to artificial life to neural networks. So there was actually a fair bit of bio-inspired stuff in there, which was fun. Planning, of course, is probably the one that most people think of when it, in terms of games. Um, and I did take a class on that, and when I was doing that, wrote in AI bot for Settlers of Catan. A uh, tabletop game lots of people like. I know you're you're excited about that genre. What else do you play that's tabletop related? Um, well, you could expand that to other games that are not video games, <laughs> shall we say. Um, I also play a lot of Magic the Gathering. Uh, it's my favorite game I've been playing for 13, 14 years now. Pretty, uh, pretty exclusive on what you like as well. <laughs> Tell people. He won't take the regular decks. No. <laughs> what do you play? Um, usually I play Legacy. I would say exclusive. Yeah. Um, I also play Modern and EDH and pretty much avoid Standard at all costs. Do you play the online version? And if so, why not? Uh, I don't currently, uh, mostly because I don't have the money to put into both paper and online. I see. Um, so I've been putting it into the paper version one. Speaking of money, why pick uh, City State as your first out of school job? Uh, I realized I could be making a lot more elsewhere, but I didn't want to be stuck with a job that I didn't really enjoy. I'd rather do something I love and just be happy with it. Um, and I've always loved video games and I've wanted to make games since high school, um, so I decided to get into the game industry. Um, City State in particular was very interesting to me in that it's uh, a startup and it's filled with people who know what they're doing, which is great. <laughs> um, and the project Camelot Unchained is very interesting and I Personally, I'm very excited to see where it goes and what it turns into. So you like the process of the development from nothing? Yeah, that and it looks like a game that I would love playing. Ah, uh, I can see that with your uh, magic background. <laughs> so what are you going to be working on for us here? Um, I'm pretty much going to be working on whatever needs work on it. Currently I'm working on uh, projectiles, which will eventually be, you know, arrows, rocks, fireballs, whatever. Anything else you want to share? Otherwise, uh, we will wait and all of the archers out there who are very excited to learn more <laughs> will get to see your, <laughs> your flying arrows soon. Hopefully soon. Hopefully soon. Thanks again, Rob, and I'm sure the team will hear more as we progress further into development.